Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Woo! Hearts are flowing. Energy's flowing. Very exciting. Oh my goodness. This is good. Good afternoon. Good evening, really, if you're on the East Coast. Good afternoon if you're on the West Coast. Very exciting. Very exciting. How are you? I can't read your comments because I'm driving, but I really do hope that you swipe to the right and share. Swipe to the right and share. Welcome to GTV, baby, GTV. This is awesome. Stop sign. Hey, guys, stop sign. (laughs) GTV, baby, GTV. It's Gloria Mayfield Banks. And if you're talking about me, hashtag Gloria Banks. Glow Nation. Hashtag Glow Nation. Okay, so I'm going to be driving for a few minutes, and the first thing I want to tell you is that I wanted to wish you happy Independence Day. Happy Independence Day, and happy fresh start. That is exciting. Oh my God, a three-day weekend is exciting. A three-day weekend where you can relax, have fun. There's some people at my house right now, right now, cooking. Hi, Keith. Hi, Bryce. Cooking right now. My grandgirls are there. Very exciting. They have a girlfriend over. House is hot and popping right now. TV's flowing. Music flowing. I gotta put some music on. Movies flowing. Food's flowing. So, of course, I had to make a run to the grocery store to get some things. Yeah, I'm not cooking, but I'm assisting, sort of. Okay, so I wanted to talk to you guys for just a second because this is a Independence Day and we're so grateful grateful for all the people who have assisted us in our independence. You know, Ken and I were parking last night at a hotel and Ken has amazing people skills, like amazing people skills. So he's talking to the guy who does the valet and he was making him feel amazing and asked him, uh, the guy shared with us that he had been, had a military background and he had gone on four tours, you guys, four tours, four, yeah, four tours. And so Ken made him feel phenomenal and just thanked him and You know, Independence Day is for a lot of reasons. But I also know that if you meet me for the first time, that what I do is I teach the ordinary person how to create an extraordinary life. And most people would would define joy and happiness by the number of free choices that they could make, by the level of independence they created for themselves. And here's the beauty of July the 2nd is that it's a fresh start and it's a fresh time. Now, here's what some people do. Some people have a fresh start. They're so excited about the fresh start. And guess what they do? They go and they just continue doing what they've been doing without any evaluation about what was great and what wasn't great. Now, how do you change the course of where you're going if you haven't stopped and evaluated what you did fabulously and what wasn't so fabulous. What amazing choices you made and what choices weren't so great. I want to caution you not to spend the majority of your time thinking about what you didn't do well. That's when you'll get stuck. So make sure you spend a great amount of time picking out what you did very well so that you can continue doing that. And then be honest with yourself and decide on the course of action for changes. So let's just park right there for a second. And let's just say that you have identified a habit that does not serve you well. Okay, so I'm going to tell you about a habit I have that does not serve me well. A habit I have that does not serve me well is not being early. I mean, I work hard to be on time, and I'm not great at it. But I really, really would love to be more on time. And so that's a habit that doesn't serve me well yet. So if you have a habit that doesn't serve you well, the best thing you can do is to replace a habit. You don't stop being late. You start a new habit. For me, you guys know I'm very transparent. I talk about it. I put things in place that help me 
be on time. And I'm not great at it, but I'm going to become really great at it. Why? Because I'm very conscious about it. I'm talking about it. I'm thinking about it. I'm aware of it. So I'm just saying to you that as we go into this fresh start and as we create a whole list of things that we want to broaden our independence on, that we evaluate where we're great. Okay, so where am I great at in terms of my broadness of independence? I am very independent and safe at being transparent. And my transparency has caused me a lot of joy. It stops um, the feeling of insecurity because I'm truthful about myself. I'm very transparent with people. When I can't spell something, I let them know. If I don't know the way, I tell them. If I'm confused, I ask. I'm okay with being transparent. I'm not trying to uh, hide where I have weaknesses. I let people help me. I let people help me. And that has broadened my level of independence substantially. So I just want to really quickly go in here and wish you guys a very happy Independence Day. An amazing, an amazing fresh start as we continue on our journey to create an outrageously phenomenal, exciting, exciting, pleasant, fun-filled, juicy holiday season. Fresh start, new life. Here I am at the store. Talk to you later. Bye. Fresh start. Happy Independence Day. It's your girlfriend, Gloria Mayfield Banks. If you're talking about me, hashtag Glow Nation. Bye from GTV, baby. GTV. Talk to you later. See you later. Don't forget to follow me on Snapchat because I am having such a great time. Snapchat at Glory Banks. See ya. Oh yeah, this will be lifted to YouTube. You know that, right? You know that.